This is a new drone from China. Got it. Oh, good. So now it's calibrated? Yeah. Okay, so that was a good demonstration on how to calibrate your drone. Please put a like here <laughs> so that we can, you know, continue this show. Because we need revenue. And subscribe. Subscribe to our channel. It would really help us out. And, of course, we're on Patreon also. Oh, oh there just, it goes. Just tell them to send money. Just send money. <laughs> Now let's see if you can get it started. Oh, I can, but I'm setting all the parameters first. See, we're going to try and take a picture of the property from above. There's some mountains over there. Natural cacti. Boy, a nice ranch house. That's the owner's house. And then there's the old original house from the old days. When it was a way station. We can take a close look at the drone from here. It's really something. Great for taking aerial photos of real estate. It makes real estate look a lot more expensive than it really is. Okay. Let's go around and look at the front. Done. Calibration is done. Yeah. And look, it looks kind of mean from the front. It looks like the War of the Worlds or something when it's yeah. coming at you. Pretty soon we're all going to have drones that will protect us, then they'll be armed. You know? So we fired it up. But there's still no image. But it seems to be functioning. Maybe you're, you're uh, you didn't. There's not allowing the camera. It's not allowing it. The, the phone. Oh, now sorry, this SD card won't. Uh... Try to take a picture. I guess the wind's picking it up and blowing it a little bit. Maybe. But you still don't have the image, huh? No. Nope. You can't see me? No. Nope. I think you don't, you're not allowing the photo and the phone. No, that's all for Maybe you need to update the software. Maybe that's what the problem is. So there you see it, but we still can't get the camera operating right. There he is controlling it. Hit that like button. Huh? Subscribe to our channel. <laughs> we accept PayPal.
Well, we have the image and now we are going to send it off and make its first orbit. Vaya con Dios. So we're aloft now. Look at that. We're up in the air and we're looking down at the property. This is the first time we've be, uh, we are operating the drone. And uh, all looks good. We're still in our learning curve, of course, being the first time. Wow, I, I don't like that tree coming up. Uh, let's see if we can, uh, oh no, oh. Oh, 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 no, oh, oh, wow, that was lucky. Well, now we're looking southwest, um, down valley from the property. You can see that there's lots of oak trees. And um, we're making a, we're going to circle back to where the two houses are. And uh, hopefully land, you know. Uh, I think we bit off a little bit more than we could chew on the first orbit. But we'll see. I mean, um, oh, it looks like another tree is coming up. Uh oh, now we're going to miss it. Yeah. Oh, ooh. yeah, we missed that one, too. Um well, <laughs> all's well that ends well. Yeah. Um, so now we're back to the houses. Yeah. So we did it. Uh, that's our first orbit. And, and, and I, I'd say that was a success. Well, here we come. The drone is coming back from its... Before the battery... We only have 30%, so it came back. It's a great victory. We were able to pepper spray three Taliban. Mission accomplished. The climactic scene from the independent film Lady Muerte was filmed out at the ranch. The colors were just fantastic, and the film crew was really happy with the result. And, um, well, let's hope to, that the film makes its debut soon and, and uh, because it, it really was a good ending.